You may skip to the seventh minute mark if you're only interested in the labbing information. Medallion, are you? Battle one, fight. I yeah, had to take that. What? Forgive me. Damn it. Uh, I should, I should take a look at exactly how mine is that is on tech. All right, he likes backstepping a lot. That's safe. Wow. All right. Huh? Oh, hello? I could have rung him out there. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Could this be? Come on, what's with this lag, bro? Check this out. Oh, come on. Jesus! Why do these people go online? I don't get it. I don't. I actually don't get it. What the fuck? This is how it's gonna be. I know for a fact these are all strings that. These are probably all strings that I can duck or something. I'm going for this just to get a quen stack. Oh, come on. He backsteps so much. And tech crowd. I tried to duck, but he's so evasive. Bro. I need to take there, huh? All right. He's gonna go for a K because he can't ring out. Right, he read that. This won't ring out. Shouldn't have gone for that. Kill this? No, won't. I'm I'm seeing some patterns now. Battle two. Fight. I need to take that. That I, I'm gonna lab this after. I'm pretty sure I need to take. It. There's no way it's guaranteed. I don't believe it. Not for a second. I knew he was gonna go it. No. Like last time he was on his ass, I went for the counter, he didn't do it. So, fuck man, such an, an such annoying shit to deal with. 
I'll try to step it. Oh, fuck me, I guess. He's kicking the router again or something. I don't know. Alright. Battle one. Fight. Stay down. Get the Quen stack here. Oh my god, that's supposed to counter it. I need to take that. That I need to figure that out immediately after this. Just right now when he's hitting me with it, I don't recognize that's the situation I'm in until it's too late. I yeah, it's too late. What the fuck are these moves? I've never seen these moves. Re reversal edge. Naturally. Yeah. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. I guess. Shitty ass mechanic. That fucking move. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm out of here after this match. I need to figure that out. I was mashing too much. I need to figure that out. Not your lucky day. All right, into the lab we go. Into the lab. So we're looking at the move here. It's gonna come up. All right. Okay, so, what I try to do now is interrupt after blocking the first hit, it does, which doesn't work. Let's see if we can Earden. Earden gets interrupted. We might be able to GI. That's a fat GI. That's a level 3 GI, so that's a good answer. Now let's see if this is... I'm assuming this is an echo combo. Yeah. Then we need to tech. And we need to tech to the sides. Now let's try to see what we can punish with. Yeah, so I-16 doesn't work. Um, which explains why this guy was going for it. It's Considering the payoff, this seems pretty... But I-14 punishes do work, so... Okay, I'm back. Uh, he does have another option off of that string, and it's pretty interesting, so I'll go over it. So... He, uh, he... Let me pull up the move list for a second. So he can do off of Monument ABK, which I haven't looked at yet, and he can do AK A plus B, which goes into the unblockable. Um, now I mentioned that you can GI the AK, here you can also GI the AB, the AB rather, and there's no mix-up uh, in terms of timing. Okay, you can mash the GI, and it too will be a level three GI, and there's no variable GI timing. You can mash it out for both. That's good. However, I found something. I found a better way to deal with this string. Essentially, one goes into a high, the other goes into a low. So. You, you notice how I ducked, uh, or blocked, I think. I blocked the second hit by holding low. For this other string, it's the same thing. Right? So, I can... I block the first hit, I duck the second, which will either be a high or a low, whatever. Then I block high again. If he does the non-unblockable string, I get an I-16 punish. If he does the unblockable, I can sidestep and um, punish him. Alright, so to summarize, the, the first uh, string path he has off of Monument A. Um, let's see what we have to do on block, right? Let's, let's summarize this again. Then we go low, and then we sidestep. But we don't even need to sidestep, but I think this makes it easy. You know, makes, makes the punish a bit more universal. Um... 
Now, on hit, um, this is a natural combo. So we need to tech here and then do the I-14 punish. That's this first string. Second one is much of the same. You block again, go low, and then I'm supposed to keep blocking actually. And then I get an I-16 punish. So, ideally, um, you, know, you know, you would not expect Killick to just do these strings, I think. Good Killicks wouldn't do that. Um, they're, they're, they're gonna hit confirm, basically. So, uh, I th my conclusion on this string is it's not great. Um, like, the second string path is pretty good, because that entire thing... See, that's an entire natural combo, so that probably has use. This other one is just a knowledge check, because I don't think it has much purpose on block or on hit, because it's, you know, you're just testing their reactions. Um, so I just need to start reacting to this GI animation when he goes into that, block low, and then, you know, depending on what he does, I can, I can deal with this stuff. And if... You know, if for some reason I do get hit with the unblockable stuff, I should just tech it and I-14 punish. Please let me know in the comments whether you like this kind of content or not. I try to keep it entertaining and educational at the same time.